On the evening of November 18, 2009, the U.S. Embassy welcomed several hundred alumni of U.S. Exchange and Study programs. The reception was held in the Embassy Atrium and is the largest public gathering inside the Embassy to this date. The Macedonian American Alumni Association partnered with the Embassy to invite its members, Fulbright and Humphrey Fellows, Ron Brown and Ben Franklin Fellows, alumni of the Junior Faculty Development Program, participants in the International Visitor Programs, and journalists who took part in the Professional Development Year Program at U.S. Journalism Schools. Other attendees at the reception included alumni of long-term military, judiciary, and police training programs, along with USAID development programs. Our flagship exchange, the Fulbright Program, is the ongoing legacy of Senator William J. Fulbright. He recognized that after World War II, it was essential that Americans learn from an experience abroad and that students and scholars from other countries have the opportunity to learn about America by attending our universities and visiting our country. In the 18 years since Macedonia declared independence, nearly 1,000 citizens of Macedonia have been on an exchange or study program. Many of these alumni are business and government leaders, mid-career professionals, accomplished university faculty, and students with great promise and potential. The Embassy sees these alumni as the leaders of today and of tomorrow, and the embodiment of our Declaration of Strategic Partnership. Ambassador Reeker praised the accomplishments and contributions of the alumni to Macedonia. He indicated that the exchanges represent America's most important investment in the future of Macedonia, in its people and its leaders. Ambassador Reeker also noted that State Department exchange programs have included a remarkable cross-section of Macedonia's rich and diverse society and affirmed that of the billion dollars we have spent in assistance since Macedonia declared independence, I am certain that nothing has had more long-term impact than our training, education, and exchange programs. Minister of Education Nikola Todorov joined the ambassador in giving opening remarks, and the ambassador thanked the Macedonian government for their decision to begin an annual $100,000 contribution to the Fulbright Student Program thus increasing the number of Fulbright students from Macedonia studying in the United States. Many of the alumni expressed their pleasure at seeing such a wide variety of professions and colleagues represented at the reception. They shared the value of their exchanges with each other and with us in these video statements. I'm Jakos Kabashi from Skopje. I participate in the Southeastern Europe Young Leadership Institute 2002. It was a great opportunity for all of us uh, to develop uh, networking uh, and uh, we keep uh, the personal friendship and then uh, the professional communication uh, cooperation up to this date. Well, my name is Anna Fritzhand. My fellowship was at the University of Minnesota and it was an extraordinary experience. And uh, actually this event is uh, pretty valuable too uh, because its purpose is that we can actually meet each other, introduce each other and uh, promote interdisciplinary approach in science and education. Uh, my name is Lydia Nanus. I was a Fulbright alumni at Northern Illinois University uh, on the program for accounting and auditing. My stay in the United States uh, was uh, really wonderful. My name is Zoran Jovanovsky. I participated in the Ron Brown Fellowship Program from 1995 to 1997. It was a life-changing experience. Uh, my name is Tony Deskowski, professor of, at the Faculty of Law. I attended the Fulbright American Studies Institute in Boston in 2000. I I would recommend it to anybody who intends to develop his skills in the law profession. Uh, hello to everyone, I'm Christy Ivanovsky, I'm a journalist, I'm working as editor of Foreign Affairs in Dnevnik Daily newspaper. I've been twice in the uh, United States, both programs are so impressive and I had a unique chance to be in touch with American culture. I'm Command Sergeant Major Boban Stojanovic, Sergeant Major of the Macedonian Air Force. 
Uh, I was in United States 2007-2008. I, I attended the United States Army Sergeant Majors Academy. The good things was because we established a new relationship, a new connection with senior NCOs in the United States and the 38 different countries. I'm Snežana Lupevska and I was a participant of PDA program, Professional Year, in New Mexico State University. And my impression from that program are great because that was very big influence on my career. Thank you.